Well, good evening from the football hotbed that is Merseyside. We find ourselves tonight at Goodison Park. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis. Alongside me is Stuart Robson. And we've got potentially exciting league action coming up on the menu for you. It's Everton versus Brighton and Hove Albion. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And here's how Everton line up. Well, this looks to be a really defensive lineup. They've certainly not come here to dominate possession. But if they defend with urgency, they're going to be difficult to break down, that's for sure. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. Thank you for attending this night. Enjoy the match. And they kick off here. Moving it forward. Well, possibilities in the centre. And she's fired it just over the bar. bad pass oh she's in here oh marvellous goalkeeping well it's a top class save from a top class goalkeeper that's absolutely brilliant Trying to deliver it accurately. It might still be problematic. Natalie Bjorn. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. No let-up in the pressing department. Well, a good tackle. And they need to get tighter. Tremendous block. Wonderful chance. And fine goalkeeping. Well, the crowd are willing them to score here. They've created so many chances. And time for the change now. Over it comes. Being pressed and pressed high. Can they forge ahead? And the keeper was there. She did her job. Who can they pick out? Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Really vital interception. This attack looks highly promising. Well, you've got to classify that as a poor attempt. 
a long way wide Terland. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Intelligent threaded pass here. In position to give them the lead, maybe. Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Connolly, Julia Zigiotti Olme. Is it going to be? And begging to be put away. Well, questions have to be asked defensively. Not that she's going to be worried about that. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Real chance, and another one! Two quick goals, will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Well, time is up as far as the first half is concerned here on Merseyside. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Sari. Good tackle taken away. Might be a chance here. Well, a wild swing at the ball in the end. That was what it amounted to. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Carter well it was a promising avenue of attack but the momentum has been halted and you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out well it was apparently a bookable offence well no debate over that one it's a yellow card all day long
Well, the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Oh, she's in here. It's got to be. It's still alive. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. And a substitution in the offing. Well, the free kick, lacking just a little bit of guile. Well, as you can see, Everton have had most of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Lee. Plenty of support here. And there's the feed into the box. Well, it certainly wasn't easy, but a bit wayward, you'd have to say. Well, she's just missed time, that hasn't she? Didn't quite catch it how she would have wanted to, and there's the result. Graham, lovely ball over the top, really important tackle, Veatriki Sari, Megan Connolly, Danielle Carter, really bright looking attack, a routine save, Duggan and winning it back and what an opportunity this is for her it has to be surely wonderful header excellent goalkeeping well the post got in the way well no damage done Showing a real will to win the ball. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Olme. Carter. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them.